Hey folks, Lionel here with Cowboy Boots House and Western Life Enthusiasts. Today, I got a little video for you on how to get your belt buckle all polished up. I'm going to show you how to get your favorite belt buckle looking from this to this in just a couple minutes. Well, let's get into it. Alright folks, well, I got everything here that I need to get this all polished up. Here I got three microfiber rags. One of them is a damp one. And I got a Brasso here. Now, Brasso will do uh, stainless steel, chrome, pewter, aluminum, bronze, brass, and copper. So I'm sure it'll do uh, silver plating. Uh, which brings me to my next thing. So this is the buckle that has already been polished up before as you've seen uh, This is another silver plated one that hasn't been polished up um, And this is a brass uh, buckle so in the brass buckle I mean it's meant to be a little darker and whatnot We're just gonna try to get a little bit more brilliance just to uh, kind of capture the image in the background and, and the distinctive details on this more so Let's get into it. Uh, so first of all, you want to grab your microfiber rag, this one, and uh, just uh, take off all the dust out of the belt buckles. Take off this uh, little bit of the dust, just wipe it down. There we go. Now, I'm not trying to get them super shiny uh, to the point where it you know reflects the light so much I just want to get them a little shiny that's that's how I like it but if you guys do want to get it a little bit more shiny you could use the brasso and use one of those um, electric spinning wheels with a uh, uh, soft uh, brush and just you know do it do it that way and that will really bring out the brilliance but I don't like it so much like that I like it just a little bit shinier than this but you know so just basically like that so once that's been done, what you do is you kind of grab the, uh, the microfiber cloth around your finger like this. You put it right there like this. Then you just kind of swirl it around and go to town with it. Kind of go fast. And that will literally take out a lot of the uh, a lot of the scuff marks. It'll kind of fill in those little scuffs. It'll make everything much nicer and more brilliant. Uh, take out all the gunk from you know us sweating on it or whatever. It kind of leaves a bunch of residue. As you guys could see, this is all the brilliance that you guys are missing out on. Now, what you guys do? is you go back at it again like this on a cleaner side until it's all nice and polished up and you guys could see it's it, it got really dirty really quick but our belt buckle is much nicer and shinier now as you guys could see um, if you guys want to touch it again you guys can just grab the other side put another coat on there Go at it all over. Make sure you guys get into little creases and everything. And see, it's still a little bit there. Now we're not going to get it uh, again that shiny like a like a finished chrome. I like it to have a little bit of personality still. So we're just going to go at it like this. And then grab another clean side and just finish it off. I like to do uh, two coats, like I said, it's just enough. Gets it all nice and shiny without it being overly done and uh, you're wasting too much time at it. It's just supposed to be a little quick touch up. You know, you're going out somewhere, you want your belt buckle to look a little bit better, work out in the field, whatever, you know. It's got a little dirty, scuffed up. Now, once that is all said and done, you just grab your damped cloth and you wipe it off. Take all that brasso off 
because you don't want that stuff to stay on your belt buckle. That's why you got a, a damp cloth. But you don't want uh, too much water to be on your on your buckle. So then what you do is you grab that dry cloth and you just take off all the water, kind of dry it out and take out some of the other brasso residue. And that is all nice and polished off. Now that looks a whole lot better. Now we're gonna try to see, and I'm testing this with you guys, if uh, this will get a little bit more brilliant. All right. So again, we're gonna grab this. I got a clean side right here. I'm gonna put a little bit of the brasso right here. Now there's a little bit more detail, so you're gonna wanna make sure you get all that brasso off of this one. Uh, brasso's uh, not very expensive, by the way, folks. It's about five dollars or less. Now this one didn't have much dirt it's practically a new buckle but um, I think we could get it it still had a little bit and I think we could get it looking a lot better being that this is a brass polish So it's still got plenty of it on there. As you guys can see, all these little watt lines are uh, brasso. So we're basically now just trying to take it off. It's a small buckle. And we're just trying to get into the little creases and catch all them little details right here. Make sure we get all that brasso off. Again, this one wasn't as dirty as the other one. But man, I could definitely see a, a little bit of a nicer brilliance and you could see the accents between the uh, um, between every little lines to uh, see the background. Now that looks a lot better. So it's still keeping that rustic look, you know, the the brass look. So the here's our damp cloth. Now I'm just making sure I wipe every little spots off and. Just take that down. And then, once that's all said and done, all the belt buckles are done. So now we just grab this and dry it all off. Take all the brasso off. And check this out. It looks much better, much more brilliant just looks like a much nicer belt buckle. It still has that copper look, but you could definitely see the difference in the mountain and you can make out the bird, the eagle, and you can make out, you know, all the little trees and everything. Just looks so much better. belt buckles are all nice and shiny and uh, we're ready to get gussied up and hit the town well I hope this video helped you out a lot um, this you know it's it's a simple way of doing it uh, but uh, it, it is definitely effective and if you guys uh, keep doing that you guys are gonna be able to uh, keep the brilliance out of your belt buckles and get the best out of them without overly doing it and without spending too much time uh, Brasso is a very easily accessible thing it you could find it at Walmart uh, also you could find it in Amazon basically anywhere uh, all the major stores uh, sell Brasso uh, so it, it's not that hard to get and it's only about less than five dollars so it's definitely worth it uh, for a few minutes just to have a nice uh, bright belt buckle well that is all I have for you guys today folks if you guys like this video hit like and subscribe to the channel Hit a little bell notification. We have a lot more things coming up. And I want to thank you guys so much for your support. I really do appreciate it. Have a good one.